Hey guys, what is up the new Cubist here? Welcome to Minecraft 2 episode number 8. Alright, so if you missed last episode, we built a really cool cow pen, so go watch that. We also did a little bit of mining. Um, we got quite a bit of resources, and by quite a bit I mean literally quite a bit. Look at all this. Um, so we shouldn't be needing any coal anytime soon, which is a good thing. I also pretty much have infinite food now, which is nice. Uh, but look at all this iron, guys. It's literally filling up every one of our furnaces. So we're going to have close to four stacks of iron, which is a good thing. Um, we have more gold ore than we really need. I don't really ever use gold anyways, so it's not that helpful. But it is nice. Um, more coal. We're going to make this stuff into blocks. Uh, but look, we have 17 diamonds now. We have a bunch of lapis. Uh, a little bit more redstone than we had. Again, I'll make this into blocks in just a second. And then some more irons. But some more irons. Some more emeralds. Uh, but it is nice to see that we have 17 diamonds. But yeah, let me make most of this stuff. We have a cobblestone chest now, by the way. Which we did transfer all of our cobblestone over to the big boy over here. Uh, you know, and listen to it open. <laughs> it, it's storing all of our cobblestone in here. Um, how much... Is in there is just a mystery to me it's a lot and we are probably not gonna ever use all that but you know what it's fun to have anyways um, we did uh, clear out this tree area over here so again if you missed the last episode go and watch it it's a good episode for sure um, we did a lot of fun stuff Ooh, I don't want to lose that uh, but I am trying to expand this sugarcane farm ever so slowly um, you know honestly I wish it would go quicker but I can't force the game to do anything uh, but we do need to breed our cows. I'll put up my inventory. I said I was going to make this stuff into blocks. So let me not lie to you guys and actually do what I said. Oh my god. I've been doing this wrong my whole my whole Minecraft career since they added this. Look, you can just click on it and it'll just make all the blocks for you like super quickly. So look at all this. We, <laughs> we have enough <laughs> coal. 51 coal blocks, 47 redstone blocks, and 29 lapis blocks. I think we're going to be okay. And we'll put our mining hammers into here. Uh, yes, and we do have a good bit of food. I really don't need to be carrying around bread um, when I have steak much better saturation uh, But let's go check on our cows. Um, let's see how they are doing. We constructed a very nice looking pen I think it looks good at least um, I guess it's better than your default pen. That's just kind of I don't know as boring as can be um, So I hope that this is better than you know what I could have made if I didn't exhibit any effort um, Or exude any effort I guess Let's see, one, two, three, four. Okay, so we're, we're getting a good bit of cows. It's slowly but surely type deal. Um, you know, I can't make the cows grow quicker than they already grow. Uh, so let's just get out of here because they're, they're starting to swarm me. They're very anxious. They're anxious cows. Um, but yes, in this episode, I don't know if I wanted to start my wall or not. Um, I don't know how big I want my wall to be. I really don't. Um, but I want to make it out of something other than just cobblestone. Um, which may be a feat in and of itself, like me having to smelt a bunch of cobble. Uh, I really don't know. Uh, maybe we'll make a big thing of furnaces and then just smelt it all. I really don't know, but we'd have to use most of our... Isn't that satisfying? Uh, we'd have to use most of our supply of... What you call it? What do you call it? Coal, yes, to smelt all of our, our cobblestone. Um, I do want to get enchanting going pretty quick. I'd love to get a diamond hammer. I really would. That would be super fun. Um, let's see. What else do you do in a normal Minecraft world? Um, I kind of want to make like a place to cook food at and make food. I kinda, not, not a barn per se, but like a... I don't know how to describe it. We need to get a chicken farm too. Look at all these seeds we have. We could have like a massive chicken farm. Um, how useful would it be? I don't know since we already have all this beef. Um, but you know, it, it, it wouldn't hurt to have, I guess. Okay. So... <laughs> You know, we got a little bit more wheat, which is good. I'm just going to go put the wheat up into the, the cow pen barrel. <gasps> or whatever you call it. I wonder if cows have, like, clicks. You know how in prison there's, like, clicks of people? Or, you know, high school or middle school or whatever school you're in. L look at all these. There's, like, clicks. This guy's alone. This guy's alone. These guys are, you know, that's a family. And that's a family. I, I, I guess th those are the separatist cows. They're just over there. They're hiding. They don't want to be seen. What the heck? <laughs> Did you see that? The chest had like a good delay there. Um, okay. Alright, so let's figure out how to make a smoker. I feel like I should know by now, but I don't. Okay, really? It's just logs in a furnace? For some reason, I thought it was a lot harder. Um, and it is kind of a pain having my cobble over here for when I need to craft it, but at the same time, not that big of a deal. We'll take a couple stacks of cobble. We don't need more than that. I kind of ruined the organization in there too. I mean, it's not really organized, but there was a list of cobblestone. Now it's disrupted. 
Okay, so we'll make a bunch of furnaces. I hope I don't need more than 24 furnaces. Probably not. And then we're going to look up the smoker recipe. There we go. 16 smokers. So I wanted to make like an area to cook food in. Something that looks pretty, I guess. And we'll put the furnaces in there. Um, we have a little bit of extra bricks, which I think would be more useful if we made them into walls. We can't. It's not actually that, that many walls at all. Okay, what about slabs? How many slabs? 18 slabs, that's good. Uh, what other materials do we have a lot of? We have a lot of extra stone brick. Okay, so we can do something with that. Uh, we have a lot of this, a lot of this. Yes, okay. Can we make lava stone into slabs or anything? Yes, we can. Alright, so we're going to make a smoke shack. I don't really know what to call it. I'm just calling it a smoker shack because that's where we're going to cook all of our food. Um, we'll build it over here. Um, I kind of want it to face outwards. Uh, well, you know what? We'll make it face this way. So first of all, we need to figure out where we're going to put all the smokers. Um, I think I'm just going to have them in like a stacked array like this. Um, with Okay, I have to shift, shift jump. <laughs> that's harder than it looks. Uh, I just want them to face all the same way. Okay, two, three. You know what? We don't need this one extra smoker. Um, and now we need a way um, to get the smoke out of here. You know, because you don't want to get smoked out when you're in the smoke shack. You want all the smoke to be um, converged into something. So I'll put like a stair right here and a stair right here. And then do this. And then have a stair right here. And a stair right here. And then we'll have this be like the chimney. Or something, I really don't know. Um, something like this. We don't have any cobwebs to make this look good uh, good with, but it already looks okay. So that'll be like an array of smokers that will be smoking food. Uh, and then we need to build something around it that looks better. <laughs> I guess we're not just going to do that. That looks like a hat of some, some sort. Like a, some sort of hat. Not what I'm going for. So the back obviously has to be covered. We have all this fancy lava stone, um, lava stone slabs, which these look cool. Um, you know, it's fun to get to use new blocks. It really is. Um, and in the front, we're going to make into like some sort of, again, it's not going to be like a full structure, I don't think. It's just going to kind of be like a shack. If I, How many times can I say the word shack? I don't know. We'll, we'll try to set a record here. We'll go up with these stairs, and then we'll go up with bubbles, down with air. What was it? Down with bubbles, up with air. I don't remember. If you guys know what I'm talking about, you know, you, you're the OGs if you know what I'm talking about. We're talking about SpongeBob. We're talking about SpongeBob. Okay, that would block it if I put this here. Yeah, there's no point in doing that. Well, I don't like how it looks without it. And honestly, right now, it just looks like a weird, a weird, uh, I'm not sure. You know what? Maybe some brick slabs will help. What, will they actually help? No, not really. And this this is kind of... Oh, okay. There we go. See, I'd really like to have the, these here. You know what? The, we'll, we'll just remove this smoker. We'll just remove this smoker. Because I, wa I want this structure to look good. I don't want to just have it look all bad. Um, and honestly, I don't think we're going to need more than that. Um, and then we need some sort of roof. So, something like this. That doesn't work. Okay. Fine, I'll just... I'll, I'll beat the system here. Okay, okay, come on. Okay, and then we need to go right there. All right, so that, hold on, I'll fix it. We're not gonna leave, we're not gonna leave it like that. We're gonna make this smoke shack look as good. How many times can I say smoke shack? It's like I'm just having a competition with myself internally. Okay, now when I look at this, I feel pain because it doesn't look good. Um, you know what I need to do? I need to grab some lanterns. This, lanterns always solve every problem you ever have. Um, lanterns can be used for a number of things, including solving problems of looking badness. Uh, we'll put these lava stone slabs all around it like this, just to, uh, you know, make it look better. I think, I can't put them right there. Can I put them right there? Are these really all on half slab increments? Uh, do I even need this slab right here? No. Can't even see it anyways. Okay, so two lanterns make it look nice. Oh, we can hang a lantern there, but that kind of blocks our whole, uh, our whole looking at it in this okay so those slabs look fine I don't think it needs to extend out this much I think like right there is perfect uh, we will put some walls though like this and then we will expand this out one more like that so you made good use of the brick uh, the brick slabs uh, like this block right here doesn't need to be here these don't need to be oh yeah these need to be here the struggle of building 
The struggle of building. I should I should write a book about the struggles of building in Minecraft. Uh, okay. Does that look good? Uh, yes and no. Maybe a stair right here. Yeah, and then maybe a inward facing stair. Inward facing stair. Oh nope, that doesn't work. Okay. Uh, boom. There we go. See that exudes quality. And then we'll put something like this on the back. And then like, I'm just trying to make it look good, okay? You know what? That actually, I'm happy with how that turned out. Compared to what I was thinking it would look like when I first started, it doesn't look how I had imagined it, but it does look good. Um, and then we'll, you know, have a little area in here to stand in and such. And we could put some barrels in here, maybe some chests for food. Something like that. I can't use any of these materials, though. If you have structured materials, try not to use them for the floor. Um, I always try to stick with like floor materials, you know, you know, being some, somewhat unique. We have a nice, you know, redwood floor in there, so why not a nice redwood floor in here? Doesn't look bad, looks pretty good. And then maybe do it like this, just to kind of round it out. There we go. Okay, so we have our smoke shack, and now we can smoke things in here. Um, we probably want to start building some sort of, you know, path system between all these structures. We have a farm, mine, house cobblestone chest storage I'm gonna go check on this stuff man that was a dangerous maneuver there I walked over the okay I'm gonna stop doing it because I could fall in very easy and break my leg and my heart all on, all on one foul all on one f f fell foul sweep what is it all on one foul swoop I think that's it that just sounds wrong one foul swoop hmm let me ask my girlfriend hold on she doesn't know, and I don't know. She says it sounds right. Foul swoop. Foul sw One foul swoop. That just sounds not right, but you know, I don't know. All right, let me put up all these building materials, and then we'll get on to the next objective, which I don't know what it is, but I'll think of it. All right, so I think for the paths, um, we do have a lot, and I've made a lot of cobblestone, so I'm thinking cobblestone, um, cobblestone, maybe like some andesite or something, some diorite. Andesite, diorite, I said those backwards. Uh, maybe these materials could be useful um, for building a path. I really don't know. Um, I want to have like some stairs. Um, and then obviously I want to have some of these. Uh, and then use the rest like this. Okay, so we only need a pickaxe and a shovel right now. We don't need food, I think. Yeah, we just ate. So we can have these, these, these. And then we'll have this next to that. Okay, and then we'll go make some cobble stairs. And have some cobblestone on us. We're just going to make some paths because we really do need them. I feel like a path is always a good idea. Uh, so we'll take a little bit of cobblestone from our extremely large chest. Which is extremely large. Um, it's a little glitchy, but you know what? It stores the items and that's really all I could ask for. Um, under the house, I never really added anything. So maybe we'll do something under there as well. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but yes, we'll start making paths. Um, also, this, these stairs, I like how they're sideways, but at the same time, I always end up not using them correctly. Uh, so what we're going to do is just kind of make a path. Um, so we'll have the path go over this way, which is perfect. Uh, okay, so I dug all the paths. I realized that it's going to take a lot longer than I had anticipated. So I wasn't going to make you guys watch me dig a bunch of paths. Um, but yes, yeah, so we have most of the paths dug. Now we just have to fill them in. Um, no, I'm not sure. I kind of like them recessed, but at the same time, they'd be kind of a pain in the butt to deal with. Uh, so there's going to be kind of random stairs, like, throughout them, just to sort of add texture. Um, and what I mean by that, y you'll see what I mean, um, once we actually have it complete. Uh, but I just need to add, like, so I'm, I'm going to show you how I'm going to make this path. I've never made a path like this before, I'll admit. Um, but I'm just going to sort of go by what I've seen in the, in the past. I think I've seen this in the past. Uh, but you want to do like one material at a time so that you can ensure um, everything is as random as possible and kind of, you know, you don't want a whole lot of one block next to each other. Um, but sometimes, you know, things will end up next to each other and then we'll have this path end like right here and uh, we'll, or we'll have this path end right here and go on a smooth like finish like that. So we'll keep the cobblestone stairs and we'll have like one right here and like one right here. Okay, and then we're going to go with the diorite stairs. Or, and the, you don't want to have too many gaps next to each other. You want to kind of keep them. You don't want them to touch as much as you'd think. Um, and you're probably confused. You're like, Neo, why are you putting... If you're making a path, dude, why are you putting stairs? This is to make little gaps in the path. Um, to make it look somewhat more worn and natural. You know, not like a perfect path. 
Uh, which, okay, see, that's, actually, you know what, that's fine, I think. I think, we'll, we'll see, once we actually get it, oh, that's not okay, though. Uh, once we actually get it further done, we'll see how that looks. Uh, so we have diorite all along over there, and then we'll do the same thing over here. And uh, make this path look really good. Once it's done, it's going to look very good. I, I mean, that <laughs> that's the hope. If it doesn't look good, then I'll redo it. But if it... I have a feeling it's going to look very good. Okay, and then just a few of these. Because I realize now that most of our path is, is stairs. You can't have any facing like this because you'll actually dip down. So try to... F oh, try to face them. Nope. Okay, can we do it like this? Can we put it... Okay. Uh, so now I guess is the tricky part is finding a place to put these stairs to uh, without them connecting too much. I mean, it's okay if they connect a little bit, but you don't really want that ideally, I guess. We'll put one right there, one right there, and then one more right there. And that should be enough on this path. And we'll go ahead and put a few over here. Uh, we'll put one right there. Uh, one right there, one right there. Um, and we'll put like a backwards facing one, a backwards a sideways and then finally a backwards one okay and now all we have to do is first away first thing take away all your stairs and then put all these materials back into here and then make sure it becomes day so let me go sleep all right now what you want to do i'm just kind of casing out the whole area what you want to do is just start placing blocks kind of randomly like you did with the stairs where first of all we're going to go with whatever this white material is i don't remember the name of it i feel like i should after all this time but i honestly don't and i'm sorry uh, not really actually sorry, but I didn't I literally don't know the name of this block um, And keep in mind you have two other blocks to place so don't fill in too much um, But fill in enough to where it looks random um, That's what you're going for is the, the kind of random thing um, These paths they seem like they're harder to make than they are like if you look at them on a server and you're like How did they make that and you're like well? This is exactly how so if you ever want to learn how to make a path, you know now, you know and then start over here with, you know, the next material, diorite. Now keep in mind the rest of the blocks are going to be filled in with cobblestone. Um, with Which, if cobblestone is a majority, it's not a big deal. It really isn't. Just make sure you place at least one of every kind of block in each area uh, to keep that congruency uh, with the rest of the path. There's little holes in the path here, so it makes it kind of difficult. Uh, but try not to put too much of the same material next to the same kind of stair. Because um, I think that'll make it look a little bit weird. Um... Okay, and then maybe a couple more pieces and then look all you do is fill in everything else with cobblestone So this path will look very dilapidated, which is good That's the exact effect I was going for if you want to you can go back and add more grass I have pods all so I can't really add it back. Um, it doesn't really work uh, But it does these paths do look beautiful if you make them like this It takes a little bit more time than it would with a normal path uh, But in my opinion, I think it's kind of worth it uh, if there's areas that you feel have too much cobble, you can always remove them and, you know, of course, put another block back. <laughs> this episode's literally like a path tutorial. I mean, it's not all we're doing. We already did other stuff, but I guess the majority of this video was a, w w was a path tutorial. But that's okay. It's just how some videos go. You know, they end up being, you know, whatever I want them to be. It's the beauty of being a creator. You create what you want. And I'm creating a path in my world that looks pretty good. Okay, cool. So, look, we have a path. And it does look dilapidated. I like that a lot. Uh, make sure you don't miss any areas. So go back and double check everything. But yeah, that looks really cool. Um, and another cool effect, if you want to like make things look interesting, you could put a stair off, you know, to the side right here. Uh, you could put like you know something right here. Um, grab all your stair types, and you can do this throughout your path. You don't want to do these too often, um, but it'll make the path look a little bit more decay oh, decayed than usual. Which is, you know, a good thing or a bad thing. And, you know, it depends on your style. Some people don't like when pads don't look very, you know, even or good. Not, I mean, not good. Good and even aren't, you know, equatable, in my opinion. I think that building with a little bit of dilapidation, I like saying that word, is a good thing. Um, so we'll put, like, another stair right here. You see what I mean? It just makes the path look a little bit more lively. Maybe, like, right here there's one, and then right here there's another that's this way. Like that, it makes the little stones are off the path. You know, what kind of path is perfect in the world? Unless it's made of concrete. But you know, then it's not a path, it's a road. Am I right? I don't know. I could be wrong. We'll put one more like right here. Okay, cool. Um, now I wanna make some more lanterns. <laughs> Good thing we have a little bit of extra iron to deal with here. Just a wee bit of extra iron. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do a whole stack into nuggets. Why, you may ask? I wanna make a lot of lanterns. 
And uh, to be honest, we would have never used that much iron. We will uh, find a use for it eventually, but yes. Now that I know I can search the recipe and then just shift click it, it makes my life so much easier. Look at that. We can have a stack of lanterns. I've never had a stack of lanterns. Yay me. Um, okay, so let me put up all these stone type materials. I think this chest was for everything but cobblestone. So we'll put up everything but cobblestone into here. Everything but cobblestone blocks, I guess. This is paths. Okay, so I'm going to go grab some more cobblestone. What I'm going to do... Mm, we have the most of redwood, so it would be kind of silly not to use redwood fence. Um, so what I'm going to do is make some redwood fence, and we're going to make some cool lamp posts. Um, and lamp posts will look very good. That's not what I meant to do. I'm trying to make fence. But for some reason, I shouldn't have made it out of redwood if I'm trying to maximize the amount of redwood fence I can do. Um, I shouldn't need more than this, but if I do, if I do need more than that, I have a problem because that's two and a half, no, two and a quarter stack of, uh, redwood fence. Let's go grab some cobble and we'll make some cobblestone wall. I have a nice little crafting table right here just for cases like this. Um, I'm not going to need a whole lot of the wall, um, less than the fence, but I actually have more. That's okay. It's okay. It's a happy mistake. What, what does Bob Ross say? A happy, a happy mistake? I honestly don't know. I don't remember. Um, or happy accident. That's it. Yes, have a happy accident, you know, wherever you want. Now, keep in mind, you don't want to make these too tall. Uh, but if they're too tall, then they literally, you, they, don't, they don't, you know, give you any light, like, whatsoever. So, you don't want to do that. I can do this. No. It's like, it's like trying to, trying to hit a one, a one hit on CSGO. Okay, it's no wonder. Ah, there we go. Okay, and then we'll put another one right here. Um, it's good just to, you know, build up a little cobblestone like this and make your life so much simpler. And we're going to put all these lanterns around. It's going to make the paths look nice and civilized. I mean, you know, not civilized in the way that, you know, people are, but it makes it look like someone's put some effort into it. Which is a good thing. You want to make it look like your world has some effort in it. Especially when you're a YouTube creator. You can't go around, you know, doing things, you know, halfway. We got to go all the way here, guys. All the way. All right. Well, I'm going to place lanterns everywhere along this path. Um, I will come back in a bit. I'm not going to make you guys watch me place a bunch of lanterns painstakingly slowly. Uh, but, yeah. That's what I'm going to end up with. I'm going to do it all along my path here. All right. Looks good to me. I think it looks pretty good. Let, let's take a little walk on this path. Um, now, some of these torches now, we can remove them. I mean, obviously, the ones right next to the path, we, we're, we're not really going to need them anymore. Because, um, you know, we have our own lantern lighting. This looks so beautiful. I'm really happy we've got to a point in this world where we can actually make it look pretty good and build it out a little bit. Um, you know, the first you know few episodes of a series, you're always gathering and gathering and gathering. But once you get onto the build projects, it makes it all worth it. Um... Yeah, so let's go expand the sugar cane because we honestly need to. I'll put up all these materials soon, but as we build these things, we're getting towards our main goal, which my main goal right now is to blow up and act like I don't... No, I'm sorry. I'm not going to bring that back. I really need to get enchanting going. That's my main goal. <laughs> Man, I just can't... I can't say that without just like imagining that guy's teeth and just the way he speaks. It's just like I can't... You know what I mean? Like it's just like... Ugh. I mean, it's not a bad thing. I mean, he's, it's just like, dude. Okay, so we're getting a good bit of sugar cane. Oh, my goodness. Okay. I feel like we should have a little structure over here. I, I don't really know what, but you know what? We're just going to go with it. We're going to go with the flow. We're going to make this world look nice and pretty. We're going to go with the square. Yes, we're going to we're gonna go with the nice square here. And then we're going to put, you know what? We're going to put an enchanting table in the middle of this square. You're asking yourself, Nia, what are you getting yourself into here, man? You're making a square. This is Minecraft. You can't do that. You know what? I'm going to do whatever I want because it's Minecraft. Look at that. Look at that, guys. This looks... This looks... I don't want to say it. I don't, I'm not going to say it. We're just going to do it and then we're going to destroy it because I already started and I don't want to stop. There we go. You know what? It, look, it, it looks... Ugh, I can't say it. <laughs> I was about to say it looks beautiful, but nah, this does not look too great. Um, maybe if we do something in the center, it's going to become dark. It's going to become dark very soon. I'll go sleep in the bed and then we will, uh, we'll call it good. You know what? That's okay. Maybe the crafting table. Okay. And then maybe like a little, oh, I know what to do. 
Oh, okay. Hold on. I know exactly what to do. And you're going to be like, whoa, Neo, calm down, my guy. Actually, you know what? We're going to move this. We're going to move this. We're going to change it to be Redwood. You're probably wondering, Neo, what are you doing? Are you going crazy here, man? Oh, yeah. We're going crazy. Look at that. A beautiful structure. What? What is it? I'm not sure. But if we're going to make this look like a village, we got to have these nice little things just kind of spread out randomly throughout the world. Um, and then maybe... Will this fit perfect in the center? <gasps> nice. Okay, let's go sleep. And I'll meet you guys back in the day. Alright, we got about five minutes left in this episode. Let's go breed our cows. First of all, let's clean up this inventory because, man, it's looking dirty. Let's see. We'll put up cobblestone into here. And then we'll go put... See, look, we can use our pads to walk nicely. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? I'm going to change those stairs, though. They just... Something about them doesn't flow too well with me. I always end up falling. I always end up just walking off the edge. I think because I'm lazy. I'm not really sure why I do that, but for some reason it always ends up to be the case. I always fall down. Okay, we're not going to use these either. We'll just make them back into... Back into the full iron bars. Oh, back into the full iron bar. Oh, that's steak. My, my hand is bent at a weird angle. We'll put the nuggets down here. Flint in here. And then dirt in here. Okay. We don't need these torches, too. Okay. Is there anything in here It's not a building material? What is a bow doing in here? And a bone and a string. That's just lazy, Neo. That's just lazy. Let's go throw this. We'll put it on the roof, because who cares? We'll never know it's up there. Uh, but yeah, now that we have a bunch of sugarcane grown, RNG... Oh, that was an extra sugarcane. RNG is our friend. And it will... I'm pretty sure I miss a lot of them, and they're just floating in the water. Is that the case? No. Um, but now that we have a long string of sugarcane, which I'm still going to expand. Like, I really do like just doing an absurd amount. Um, what is going on over here? Hmm. You know what? We'll farm a little bit of dirt right here. Or something that I need to fix. Um, we'll also start colonizing this area, removing all these all these annoying little... I, I don't. Again, I don't know what these are called. This was our first base, though, if you guys remember. We ha oh man, I stripped a log. You know, we have to strip these then. Um, I had this nice little base. I built it up because I was scared. And I, when I first built this, I was like, yeah, this series is going to go nowhere. This is all the effort I can I can put. And then lo lo look, where look where we are now, guys. We're at a good point. We're at a good point. Okay. I'm happy I stuck with it instead of quitting. Because I could have quit very early on. And I don't know why I would have. I get down on myself and I'm like, oh, this world's going to turn out real bad. It's not going to look good. It's like, why would you do that to yourself? Okay. Anyways, I think I'm going to end the episode here because I don't really have anything else in me right now that I want to complete. Uh, but I am happy with how this <laughs> turned out. Our, our crafting table looks like it's like, I don't know, a super crafting table. Uh, but I do appreciate all the recent views I've been getting. It's, it is nice. It's less than, you know, it, it was a long time ago, but that's okay. We're never going to get back to the point of summer of 2019. That was just crazy. PewDiePie, thank you. <laughs> but anyways, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you guys so, so much. If you have suggestions for what you want to see on the series, definitely let me know in the comment section down below. And I will try to do as many of those things as that you suggest for this or a new series as possible. Um, know that you are appreciated, whoever you are out there. If you want to leave a comment, you'll get a heart from me. And know that I've read your comment. So if that's something you're interested in, then do it. Um, but thank you guys for watching and I will see you in another episode soon. All right. Bye.